Uh, I have an attachment for a uh, homebrew aerator. So again, this is all non-toxic stuff. So I just use my aerating attachment on a corded drill and I mixed for a good time, uh, five minutes. Now this tote is not wide enough to allow a nucleus box to sit wide all the way down. So I actually used one of these um, mortar mixing totes instead. It works a lot better. Okay, so I have these nucleus boxes. We're just gonna go ahead and dip them in this echo wood treatment. So I'll give time for the uh, mixture to seep into the, to the wood pores and the end grain. So we'll see how it works. And I use a stopwatch to put at least 60 seconds on a timer. And it says, you know, during the process to agitate uh, the liquid to make sure there's no sediment. So I just use a little paintbrush here and kind of just agitate it. I don't really try to hit anything on the box. I just really want to just, you know, keep the water moving. And then once 60 seconds on the timer hits, I go ahead and just spin the box. Okay, so that took a while. Uh, I got all of these uh, double stack nukes, uh, the lids, the bottom boards, I got a couple of extra 10 frame uh, bottom boards uh, dipped, a shim dipped, and I still got pretty near five gallons of that liquid left. So uh, that'll be put back in a bucket. And again, as long as we just mix it up really good, I will dip more woodenware and uh, it's at least a decent pre-treatment before painting. So we'll see how it goes.